Hi, welcome to the video. Uh, my name's Tom, and in this video, I'm going to introduce you to some of the features of Telescape Live, which is an advanced inventory system for live video escape rooms. So, as you can see here, uh, as a player, I'm uh, I'm waiting for a game to start. Um, one of my other teammates is is there. You can actually see his cursor moving around there. Um, there's uh, a, a button there I can use to start the Zoom uh, connection and get my connection to the live avatar, be able to see the rest of the game. So now once the game starts, the Games Master uh, may want to trigger an intro video. So we trigger a video here that plays for all the players. Uh, they can all see that and play it sort of without the street problems of streaming. Um, now once that's complete, Games Master now triggers the uh, next part of the game. Uh, and you can see we start to use the inventory system. So um, we, have, we start to collect items down the left here that we're going to use um, or we're going to be able to see. So um, I can click on here. I can now have a closer look at that. Um, so you can see also that uh, my, my teammate Carl is also having a little bit of a look. He might be pointing out something to me there. Um, now I'm going to introduce another, another item from the room. Um, so we found a map. Um, and you can see that on uh, this one we have a, a little item here. And it's actually clickable. So we have a hotspot. And there we are. There's a uh, a pirate skull there. Um, so you can you can make kind of things that the players can explore by clicking through hotspots and that kind of stuff. Um, you can also make some kind of base some kinds of basic puzzles within the system. So um, here we have some cards. You see the players can uh, manipulate them, move them around. Um, uh, you can build all kinds of puzzles using this kind of mechanic. Um, and um, we also support um, 360 views. So uh, these are great for giving people a good idea of what's in your room. So here I'm just using a, uh, a sample image, but uh, you probably want to take a, a 360 image of the inside of your room, which you can do using uh, freely available software and import it into the system. Uh, you can see that uh, 360 views uh, can also have hotspots. So uh, if I uh, click there, you can see that uh, I get a little closer view of something within the room. And um, another thing you might be wondering is, and yes, that uh, the mouse cursors also work within the 360 view as well. Um, so I'm going to look around a bit more. And here we are. Here we have a hotspot. And this is actually a special type. So we can connect multiple 360 views and allow the players to sort of to move be between them themselves. So I'm going to click there. And now I'm in this uh, probably quite implausible uh, place for it to be connected to the first one. But there you go. Um, oh, and what's this on the floor? So you can see hotspots don't have to just be those, those icons. They can be whatever you want. And here we have a key. So I'm going to click on the key. And actually, the way I've set it up here is that uh, when I clicked on it, it disappeared from here. And now it's appeared in my inventory system. So um, now within the game, I'm probably going to ask the Games Master, can we use that key to unlock that padlock? So uh, the Games Master does that. Um, and here we have some treasure. Uh, so uh, that's presumably the the, uh, the object of the game. So uh, the Games Master is now going to move us on to the winning state. And um, we end up in a, in a page that asks the players to go off and rate the game. Um, of course, this this is all uh, just the basics. You can build all kinds of things uh, within the system. Uh, we have we have a, a very easy to use editor, so it's really easy for you to take your assets and build up your games. Um, it's mainly intended to be a sort of a sidekick to uh, live video escape rooms, so live avatar games. But of course, you can build games entirely in the system as well, and some people are doing that to to really good effect. Uh, so yeah, thanks for watching um, and uh, I'll, uh, I'll see you in the next video.